Good morning, everyone. So I wanted to show you, look there, definitive proof that my crow lure is working. Oh, there he goes. Bye-bye, Mr. Crow. So here we are. I'm going to grab my basket. Head on down. Head on down. Get a good view of my hand. Oh, it's nice out here today. It's nice and breezy. Welcome, everyone. Welcome to another day. The crow lure is working just as I imagined it would. <laughs> Actually, it's nothing like I imagined it would. I really did. I thought it was really dumb. And I bet everybody watching thought it was dumb, too. Oh, there he is. There he is. See him? Meow. He was watching from afar. He crowed at me and flew away. I hope he understands I am the giver of the peanuts. I hope he gets it. Go down the slip and slide. All right. So, I hope everyone's having a good day today. It's Weirdo Wednesday, and here it is, me again. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, yeah. Perfect. Oh, goodness. Oh. I don't hear anything. Goodness. Everybody tuckered themselves out after the mud wrestling event last night, I guess. <clears throat> the chicken-style mud wrestling event. Let's see how things are looking this morning. Oh, it's drying up a little bit, looks like. Gracious, Falky Balky. Oh, goodness. Look at what happened. The poor Faverals, their water got waterlogged. Oh, my gracious. Okay. And here we go. It's first thing in the morning. Oh, good goodness. Oh, my goodness, you guys. Oh. So, uh, on that bombshell, welcome to our 148 best friends. Our subscribers, thank you so much. I appreciate it. It's very important. Every single one of you is vital because we are on the slow march to 1,000 subscribers, which means that we get monetized, and that means that our very exciting future plans for Cluckersburg come to fruition much faster. Hi, Chip. How are you doing this morning? Your speckles are getting very crazy, friend. Yeah, if you uh, if you look at the uh, the backlog of videos and take a look at Chip as Chip has evolved, uh, Chip is a, spe a speckled Sussex, and as they get older, their spots evolve, so they're like the ever-changing chicken. This is also the. Um, speckle-breasted staring chicken of northern Sri Lanka. I thought it was eastern Sri Lanka, but it's actually northern Sri Lanka, so I was corrected on that. But yeah, upper management's silly. He's a silly man. So, yeah, today is Wednesday, and we're hanging out. Ah, <coughs> uh, yeah. Say it loud and proud, friend. Say it loud and proud. Again, make sure you guys stay tuned because we've got big plans <coughs> and the, the time is coming very shortly that I can announce these big plans, but it's, uh, it's going to be a slow, painful process, I'll have to say. <coughs> a slow, painful process, for me anyway. It's, it's much slower for me. Oh, look at that. That is disgusting, you guys. You're going to have to suffer through with nasty water for a while, I'm going to have to say, because I'm not coming in there. <laughs> you guys are nuts. That's gross. This mud is just out of control. I think I'm going to have to uh, expand their horizons a little bit. I still have the chicken wire from, uh, this is Operation Green Green Grass, by the way. I have... Uh, I still have the chicken wire from when they our very first incarnation of the run out here, so I'm going to um, I'm going to take that chicken wire and I'm going to put one end here, and then I'm going to put one end here, and then I'm going to put a post in the middle and pull it out and make like a little triangle, and so they can go out in the yard and and peck at the grass. 
and then I'm going to put something here to um, keep them from getting out on this end and just let them out because see it would be see I put this piece here because this piece fits perfectly between my yellow shed and their fence now I feel it would be unethical and bad on my part it would be bad neighbor is that a piece of glass do you see that my word that is a piece of glass holy shnikes bird oh fiddle don't cut yourself i'll save you oh my god you guys i have to go into the pit oh no okay that means that has to happen that can't be there did you see that did, did someone fashion a shiv what is going on <laughs> Was there a crime committed in Cluckersburg? What is going on? Holy crap, you guys. That's a giant piece of glass. What? Oh, my word. Oh, my God. I feel like I need to have my waders on. I shouldn't be going in here in my slippers. That's for sure. Okay. Holy shnikes. Where do I step? Move, chickens. Oh, you've made a fine mess of things. Okay, I'm going to have to put something down to step on because I will seriously sink if I step on that. I can't believe there's that. Okay, anyway, but I was going to put that piece of wire and stretch it across. It's seriously like the perfect length to do that. But I feel like that would be really bad form of me to do that because I would, I would have to ask my neighbor. I can't just do that. I'm not all like forward like that I guess see how they're reaching through and trying to get the grass I feel so bad I think that's why they're digging the moat over here is because they're trying to get to the grass so something's got to happen I feel horrible that they're that they've trampled their grass so quickly all right let's get a stepping stone here because I, I see chicken danger ahead with the Oh, we'll try about right there. All right, you guys ready? If I slip and slide, I won't edit it, I promise. Yeah, I know. It's amazing, isn't it? It's like a piece of wood. Look there. All right. <laughs> Stepping stone achieved. Over we go. All right. Look at this shiv. Who did this? No. <sighs> See, the thing about this little area right here is when we first moved in here, this there was like... There was a building attached right here to this side of the of the shed and it was like a a uh, carport. It was just like open and it just had a post that came out to about where I'm standing, I think actually. Yeah, it came out to about right here. And I noticed that the chickens have pecked down over here to like some type of concrete. Yeah, this right here. That is like, like some kind of concrete or something. I didn't even know that was here, but there was a, like a little bit of gravel right here. So they had been parking vehicles under this and I tore that down. <clears throat> but uh, that was, that was when we first moved in here. And I would say that this is probably a remnant of some of the trash that was left here when the people moved out or maybe they broke it and didn't pick it up bad form bad form but yeah all right back to the pit there's my stepping stone you like that? lord have mercy you guys this is ridiculous you guys need to clean your house <laughs> i say you need to clean my house lady all right there we go all right safety town has been achieved yet again I took someone's shiv away. I can't believe that. That's a that's a that's a killing machine right there. Giant, giant piece of glass. Look at what the crows have done. They've made such a mess. <laughs> oh my gracious! They have made a mess. They've made a fine mess of things as well. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I forgot the key, as usual, so I don't get to show you the favril or the uh, buttons I'm sure there's no eggs because again I'm, I'm like I'm getting more and more positive as each day goes by that we have no we have no boys or girls they're all boys 
it's a big old bunch of boy baby buttons so I don't know I'll, I might look around for some females maybe someone will trade me some males for females or something they're not expensive you can get them you can get adult button quails for like four or five bucks so I don't know we'll see what happens I uh I'm just disappointed they're all boys. I, I really think they're all boys. Oh, no fun at all. Alright guys, I'm going to go grab the key and do some maintenance down here. Take care of the poor, <coughs> the poor Favrils and their waterlogged food. That's terrible. But I hope everyone has a great Wednesday. Again, thank you to everyone who subscribes. Please, please, please hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Um, we do morning and evening shows, so we do two a day. Make sure you take a look for them. Sometimes we do more than that. Sometimes I don't do two a day. Sometimes, you know, just depends on what's flowing. I go with the flow. So, um, thank you. Make sure you comment. Let me know where you're at, what you're about. I love to read them. I love to see them. I appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Have a good day. Bye, y'all. All right, everyone. So, Project Green Green Grass is afoot. Look at the bit of riggery that I have put together here for this bit of wonder. <laughs> so, I took the, the chicken wire that was their original enclosure, and I stapled it like three times to the shed. And then I put my shovels as posts little bit of ingenuity there and then I stapled it to the other side and then of course I had to pour all this out so yeah it's a bit of a mess but it'll be okay the birds will take care of it and then I uh, stapled it over here I still got to get the Favrils some clean food I was waiting for their bowl to dry out a bit the girls are confused they don't know how to get out here the doors wide open I put a little barrier over here so they can't get out this is just for today, temporarily, so they can get out and get some grass, maybe give their enclosure a little bit of breathing time. <laughs> I know it's not going to grow grass, but, you know, we can always hope. One can always hope. So I'm going to sit, sit out here with them for a little bit and see how they do. I've got some work to do down here so they can, they can hang while I'm, while I'm uh, farming, I guess you would call it. Alright, just wanted to give you guys an update.